Hey gamers, and welcome to another board meeting. Today I'm going to teach you the two to six player game Push, a game designed by Prospero Hall and published by Ravensburger. In Push, players will be pushing their luck, trying to collect as many points from cards without busting and losing some of their hard earned cards. We're going to start by looking at a game that is in mid progress. On a player's turn, players will either be playing cards or banking cards from their bench. When players bank cards, they take one of the colors in their bench and take all of the cards of that color and put them aside face down. Those cards can no longer be lost throughout the game. If a player chooses to play cards, they will play cards by flipping cards in one out of three stacks. After a player flips a card, he has the option of stopping or continuing to push his luck. This player would obviously keep going. You can put cards in stacks as long as it doesn't have that number or color in that stack. So this card player will keep going. They cannot put this three red into this stack because it is a red and it already has one. They will continue to go. They can't put this two on this stack either because it already has a two. They'll continue to go. Now it has to go into their third and final stack that is available to them. But say they keep going. They get the six blue, they can put this on the middle stack. And now this player has a two and a red card in all three of the stacks. So if they pull a red, card or a two, the player would bust. Let's say this player stops. This player would then choose one of the three stacks that are available to them, take all of those cards and put those in their bench. Then the next player to their left would get to choose one of the two remaining stacks, and then the third player would get to pick just the last stack available to them. Let's say this player keeps pushing their luck and gets greedy. They flip over this. It's a two. It cannot go in any of these stacks. This card is immediately discarded and they have to roll this dice. And whatever this lands on, that player will now have to lose that stack of cards corresponding to that color. So this player would lose all of their red cards. It would now go to the players on the left and they get the first choice of stacks. So they would probably take this big stack then the next player would get to choose one of theirs, the two remaining stacks, and then the final player would get to choose the last stack. But there are also two specialty cards that I want to talk to you about, and these are the roll cards. These roll cards go on any of the stacks as well, but two roll cards can never be on the same stack, just like numbers and colors. If ever a player gets a stack of cards that has a roll card, they add the cards to their bench in front of them, and then they have to roll this dice and lose any cards from that color. There are also reverse cards. If a reverse card is drawn, it is just discarded, and now after this player's turn, once they take their stack of cards, instead of going to the left, the players on the right would then get the choice. So this player would take this stack, this player might take this stack now, and finally this player would have to take this stack. After all cards in this pile have been gone and taken, players add up all of the points that are in their bench and in their bank. The player with the highest point value in cards wins. And that is how you play Push. Mm -hmm.